In this lesson, we're going to learn how to add a background image to our app. If you see here, we have here Android and iOS apps. We want to add an image background to make this app more beautiful. Okay? Let's try to add this image, this image back to, GP, to GBG. First, we have to import it in our project. Let's create a folder called SRC. Inside this SRC folder, let's create another folder, folder called Assets. Assets folder. Now let's import our image, this pack to GPG, and add it here. Okay. Now let's use it here. We, there is a component in React Native called Image Background. We're going to use it. Just don't forget to, um, to import it from React Native here. Let's wrap our code with this image background and let's give it uh, a source. And this source will be required function. And we have to pass the path of this image. We can, we have an easy way, but I want to teach you how to do it. We can copy relative path. And just give it, give him a styling to fill all the screen. Felix of one. Our app looks great, isn't it? Now let's 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 show you how to get this part. We here there is a folder called SRC. Inside this folder called folder name assets. And thus in, in this folder called uh, there's our file called pack.gpg. Now we have here an app.tsx. We want to open src folder, so we have to add a dot here. Dot means add the same at the same path. Okay, and let's get into src folder. Let's select it and slash. Let's select the assets folder and slash. Let's select our image. And we have to select the correct image with correct extension. If we put another extension like PNG, we have here an error. We have to select the correct extension. The easy way you can copy relative path from here, but I want to teach you how to do to get this paths. We can also use uh, an image background from URL, and I'm gonna show it show it show it to you. But um, I just want to. To make sure that you have learned how to use this required method, this required method. Uh, let's try another example. Let's, for example, add an image here. Let's add this image called background to PNG. Let's add it here, and let's use it. This image in the same path of the app.tsx. So no need to open any folders. We just to have the name of the image here, background. PNG. Look, great, isn't it? Our images has been added. What if we ha have a folder here called images? And this image inside it, move, let's move it. We have here an error because now our compiler can't see the, uh, an image background file inside the same root here. So it, it's been moved to images folder, so we have to to open folder called images, images, and let's add our image name. Now it works. Let's try to add an image from URL. But before it, I want to to inform you about a, a property is very important called plural radius. Plural radius. Those images background. We have to make it uh, something like plural. Uh, because we don't need to to make it affect the 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 other components, so we can make it plural. So let's give him plural radius of five, for example. Look, our images has been plural. Now let's try to import an image from URL. Let's use this URL. <clears throat> let's use this image. Great, isn't it? Let's copy it. Copy this. All you need is to make to open another object. 
and to add a URI property and to put your link here. That's the link with Git from web. Wow, great, isn't it? That's, that's uh, the image background lesson. I hope you, you enjoyed this lesson and don't forget to subscribe to get more lessons about this. Don't forget to subscribe and to hit the like button and wait me for another lessons about text inputs and styling and Felix box. If you don't understand what does Felix mean, Felix one, I just make it Felix one to fill all the screen. Uh, there's another lesson I'm gonna publish later about this Felix box and how to use Felix box, how to use justify content, align items, Felix of one or two. We're gonna describe all of this <coughs> later, so don't forget to subscribe.